So, a lot of my uh, PTSD stems from something that I call moral injury, meaning that I've been morally injured by war. That means my soul has been dramatically affected by participating in the process of war. Some people think in order to be wounded from war, you have to, you have to be shot or burned or, or in some way take on a, some type of physical trauma or that you have to participate in combat, but that doesn't line up with what I see most of the time when I'm talking with vets. A lot of vets who are suffering from PTSD never saw combat. They never left the base. Heck, some of them never even left the United States and they still have PTSD. This song really comes from that experience. I went to go see my brother play down at Tanglewood, south side of town. <laughs> 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 you don't go down there too often. <laughs> and uh, uh, Alan, yeah. isn't it? Mandolin player? Yeah. Alan uh, said, hey, I got a cousin here who's an Afghan vet. He's kind of struggling. Would you talk with him? I said, sure. No problem. So I went over the, to the bar to, to have a chat. And uh, he said, hey, man, can I buy you a beer? And then... Vet language, that's let's talk about stuff. So, I listened to a story for a while, and he was with the 188th Fighter Wing down in Fort Smith, Arkansas. And they service and fly A 10 uh, aircraft out of that base. And he told me he went to Afghanistan and he didn't leave the base, but he spent most of his time loading munitions on A-10s and doing maintenance on them, and they would take off with all this stuff, and they'd come back, and, and they wouldn't have it on there. It was oh, about 8,000 pounds worth of explosives. And uh, he said he watched that happen over and over, and it really started to wear on him. And when he got back, he started having trouble sleeping, and it really hit him in a hard way that just participating in this war had dramatically affected his soul, had dramatically affected him as a person. And I think this story in particular is a really good example of how you don't even have to go to war to wind up with PTSD. And that's where we want to wind up with the VA and healthcare for veterans in this country. Because currently the VA doesn't like to, to acknowledge that you have war wounds unless you've actually been in combat, but the reality is just going through basic training can give you PTSD. Weaponizing the soul is what happens and that could give you all kinds of issues. So this song is called The 188. It's about this guy's unit. Sing. 